Hello everyone, welcome back to our series. This is lecture series 25, Introduction to IoT. I am going to discuss about model question paper. In this video, we will be discussing about the question paper which covers module 1. Please do like, share, subscribe and comment. As your exams are nearing, this model question paper will help you get more idea on what questions to be concentrated in module 1 and how the weightage of marks will be. So here in mod module 1 questions, you have two sets of question from module 1. That is either you will be attempting these three or these three questions. So now seeing about the first three sets of questions, name the four broad categories of computer network based on reachability and explain them briefly so before attempting a question first go through the complete question understand what exactly they are asking and then start writing so this contains eight marks differentiate differentiation between iot and m2 m2 m it is six marks so with a neat diagram explain network com communication between two hosts following the OSI model, which is six mark. So be clear that wherever they have specified need diagram, first you draw the diagram, then start explaining each and every layer of that diagram neatly. And next set of question is what is IoT and the characteristics? So here you can start writing about IoT and its character, different types of character in detail you have to explain. So with a neat diagram, explain the interdependency technology for IoT planes is the total marks, 10 marks totally it is provided. So you will be completely drawing the diagram wherein each of the interdependency, each technology will be completely explained wherein each of the technologies will be, uh, will, marks will be splitted into different scenarios. So with an, finally with a neat diagram, explain internet protocol suit. So that is 5 marks. So now moving into the uh, scenarios like how the marks are equally divided. So first if you take name the four broad categories of computer network based on reachability and explain them briefly. You can uh, you, uh, first you can think that you are uh, you are describing these four uh, areas of networks in detail. So you can you, you can just draw a diagram like this so which you can which will be split as two marks so once if you draw this diagram the people who are evaluating will get to know that you are clear with this answer and you are going to explain each of this lan pan van and man in detailed way so they will get an idea uh, at the start so they will be providing uh, full marks so make sure that you are drawing this diagram and six marks for explanation that is for each of the uh, explanation of pan, lan, van, man all together it will be split as 6 marks. So totally the weightage of this question is 8 marks. Next B, differentiate between IoT and M2M. So here uh, you can see that uh, the total weightage of this uh, question is 6 mark. So when it is 6 mark make sure that at least six to seven points you are writing which are relevant to that. You can first start with the differentiation like what is IoT and what is M2M. So you can first do it briefly. So that can be your first point. Then you can tell that how IoT is significant in real world and how you, you can tell how M2M is significant in the real world. That can be your second point. And third point you can take M2M, uh, M2M and IoT interaction you can tell that how IoT is interacting with different devices and why M2M so and where all M2M is used and how it is interacting between the machines so that can be your third point and being fourth point you can tell that what is the means means for communication we tell that IoT is interacting with different people different devices so how the communication is taking place maybe you can tell that it is uh, communicating through internet connection or it is connect uh, it is uh, connecting uh, through some protocol so you can start uh, explaining that and finally you can tell that why m2m is part of iot and you can justify that so m2m is obviously it is a part of iot and you can tell in what way m2m is differing from iot and you can give justification for that examples can be provided so each of the point will uh, will be split into different marks See, with a neat diagram, 
explain the network communication between two hosts following the OSI model. So here this diagram, this is the diagram for this question. So make sure that you are drawing this diagram because they have asked OSI model. So a OSI model generally it has seven layers wherein in the uh, in this diagram you are specifying the more important layers, physical data link, transport and application layer. And they have asked how the network communication between two hosts is done. So you are, you are going to tell that how the physical medium communication is taking place between host A and host B. So this diagram will have two marks and explanation of each of the layer with how the host communication is taking place will have four marks weightage. So totally six mark weightage. So the next subdivision or choice, what is IoT? Write the characteristics of IoT. Now you can tell that what IoT is actually. It is an internet of thing. If you write like that, nobody will give you marks. So you have to be precise in your answer. That is the internet of things is interconnection of different devices. So how it is interconnected? It has several nodes which is interconnected. How these nodes are connecting to the devices? How the communication is taking place through IoT? Is it, uh, is it used in different application in the real time scenario? So all those justification can be given for what is IoT, which will have two marks. And the characteristics of IoT system will have weightage of three marks, wherein the characteristics of IoT, you have to explain all this, like uh, uh, security. So how I IoT is giving you security? How the connectivity procedure is? So what is the architecture of IoT? Is it scalable? So what network it has been using, how intelligent it is, how the data are collected and transmitted. So how a, a, a fault in the IoT network can be identified. So there are many characters that is uh, coming under the characteristics of IoT. So if you explain all those characteristics, then it is weightage of three marks. So totally this question have five marks weightage. B. With a neat diagram, explain the interdependency technology for IoT plane. So this is the diagram which consists of three marks and you will be explaining the interdependency between your M2M, IOP, IOE, CPS. So how uh, these, uh, how it is being scaled up across different technologies, how, they, uh, how each and every technologies are dependent on each and every other so when when you are seeing about the evolution of iot we tell that from 1990s how it was followed and now we have ended up with iot or now we have ended up with machine learning so the how the evolution was and each of the evolution you can tell that each data or each technology was dependent on the other technology so that can be explained which is uh, the complete weightage will be six marks so totally this will be around 10 marks and now with neat diagram explain internet protocol suit you can have this this is the abstraction uh, layer that you're following in the internet protocol uh, suit which is link layer internet layer transport layer and application layer so you will be explaining each of this layer which will be of three marks and you have to tell what is internet protocol suit why internet protocol suit all those should be explained uh, which will be consisting of two marks so this is how the mark split up will be given for each of the questions. So your question itself uh, will uh, make you understand how the marks will be split. So read the questions carefully and attend the question. So this, these are the questions, important questions for module one. Stay tuned for more information to discuss about model question paper of module two. Thank you.